Ready, let's go. Okay. Continue off where we last left off a couple of days ago. And let's try and not die like 40 times the moment I start, because that was annoying. What the fuck? That took a while to get pulled across. Oh, it took almost a minute and a half just to just for the shit to go live on Mixer. Fuck me. Oh well, shit happens. All right. What was I doing again? Oh, what the fuck? Come on, motherfucker. There, yeah, it's better. Uh, radio, jump start the tower. Before you can transmit the data to Phineas, you need to give the tower a jump start. Uh oh. You want me to go outside? Good enough! Let's go, allons-y. <laughs> yeah, I tried playing this last night, but the mixer server was down for some reason. Every time I tried to start the stream up with the OBS, it told me to fuck off. Just like, could not connect to server. Tried it again, could not connect to server. So I eventually just gave up and ended up playing Apex instead. I only played a few matches though. It was getting late at night, so I ended up going to bed afterwards. I'm like, fuck it. Shooty matches, not worth it. Alrighty. Testing one, two, check, check. Sweet stars. But that is a beautiful sound. Can you hear me? We are a go for broadcast. Oh, and I also dispatched Phineas his data. Impatient prick. <laughs> I'm now indebted to him for it. Now I'll kindly thank you to get out of my tower. So can I kill you? There's no need to assert your dominance. I doubt I could make you do anything you don't wish to. Look, I am well aware that at times I may have the tiniest iota of a prickly exterior. But I must admit I have grown rather fond of you. As Nioka can attest, Nioka. I do not form attachments with many. Do take care. Why, he told us to leave without flinging insults at our persons. He really does like you, Captain. Wait, it is on the beach. What blasted hell is that? And here comes the ship. Yeah? Whose ship was that? Looks like a UDL ship. Based on the gunnery attachments, I guess it's one of the board's blockade enforcers, but don't cite me on that. Oh well, a pity for the crew, but I can't see how it affects me. Hiram? Can you hear me? Did you see that? Architect saved me from swindlers and fools. Sanjar, what are you bloody doing on my channel? Did MSI or did MSI not cease broadcasting? Well, this is something of an emergency. Elaborate? The vessel that just went down is a UDL gunship. One of the most formidable offensive ships short of an Earth Directorate assault cruiser. We could use the gunship's armaments to defend Stellar Bay, but we need its targeting module. Listen, I don't care a single whit what you do, so long as you... So you want me to go to the ship? Which means, get off my void damn channel! I'm more than finished with you lot. There we go, we jump out of the fucking tower. Now we have to go... 
to the ship. Oh, what the fuck? How the hell could you take full damage from that shit just then? It wasn't even that fucking high. I mean, yes, I'm gonna take full damage from this motherfucker. Yeah, took full damage. Look, <laughs> you son of a bitch. I guess I have to equip the damn quest. Oh, a faction quest. I'm pretty sure the ship landed in this direction. Oh, fuck me! Oh, there's my first death box of the stream. <laughs> you son of a bitch! I died for fucking falling damage. That's like the biggest, shittest way to die. Like, if, if I die in a fucking gunfight, so be it. But for, dying from falling is like some fucking stupid shit. Oh, for fuck. I keep on pressing Paul's. Been playing too much other shit. Alright. So apparently, you have to go to the sulfur pits. Probably easy just to fast travel to this motherfucker right here. Back to my ship. The landing pad. And head out from there. That's him. We're going on a trip to most likely somewhere hostile. Oh wait, I'm inside my ship. Huh? Oh, I am alert and awake. Not to worry. I take our ship's security highly seriously. Hello? Oh, where's the front door? Yeah, so this is my hiding spot now. Hello. I was looking for a place that was quiet. I figured the kitchen would be louder than the hold, so Ugh. here I am. Cozy like, ain't it? I think it's time to get a move along. What? You want me to leave? Captain, you can't mean it. What, what the fuck was that be- would that be an option? Oh, that's a relief. Thanks, I want her Captain. to come with me, not Let fucking me kick around. her from the party. Fucking owl game. Tinker with my gun. It will cost 85 bits. Tinkering items can be no greater than fu- oh. You're basically leveling up your gun. Level 15. Level 16. Level 17. What the hell? Oh, the Peacekeeper's level 5. That's why it's a piece of shit. I need to upgrade that like a motherfucker. Now that's level now that's like level twelve. Oh, I don't even have enough money for that. Damn. It costs four thousand dollars just to level up again. Probably because it's a legendary weapon, that's why. Seems 
Seems like it's a it's a rare it's like one of those golden guns, basis choice weapon. Yeah, to get it to level thirteen, I need four thousand bits just to upgrade, which I don't have. I only have sixteen hundred left, and this one I can't upgrade anymore. This one's max level as well. Uh, I guess that's all for now. Unless I have some modifications I can add. Repair, unequipped, breakdown. No, I think you can only add modifications on a modifier. Here we go. Magazine. Magazine plus. Increase my magazine damage type. You can make it shock rounds. This one is Ray. Oh, you can increase your magazine by three bullets. I'm going to go with this one. There. Now I've got a nine shot revolver. There. Now I actually have two fucking companions instead of one. It's like, classic. I forgot to equip her. Now we can actually survive better. Then again, I wasn't doing that bad with only one companion following around. Especially since that Nyoka person is a heavy weapons person with her giant laser rifle. Gatling laser, whatever the hell it is. So you keep Monarch safe, huh? That's real honorable work, Miss Nyoka. Oh, no, no. Mid Nyoka? Monarch ain't safe, even with me around. I've just got into my knowledge of its dangers and an abundance of fortitude. I scrap that shit. Breakdown. 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 Break it down. There we go, we'll just keep the ball a hat though. This is a fucking souvenir. Read. Folks hire me because I know what you can shoot and what you ought to run from. That's a mistake you only get to make once. Now I have to make myself all the way to the salt <laughs> Hello. There we go. Lock and load. To shreds, you said. Nyoka needs help. Nyoka needs help. Yeah, these things are sons of bitches. There we go, that one's dead. Toss ball. It's got a card. Ring? Holy crap, this one. That one was a big motherfucker. What was that? Unlock. All the adrenal shit. All the mods, weapon parts. Random crap. This is like, apparently this is junk right here. I don't know, they class, I guess it's a quest item, but. 
Yeah, I can't even use that shit anymore. Probably because the person I who gave me that quest is dead. This is what you get when a corporation takes a dump and walks off without cleaning it up. Whoa! Kill the mana queen. Oh my golly gosh. Somebody tells me those titties right there are a weakness. Lock and low. There, we killed that one. It's covering its weak spot up. Oh, shit. Sent me some ligma. Damn mana swarm. Come on, kill it. Kill him. Right, we can loot him now. Manti carcass. I guess that's just like loot for like selling or something. But I don't see any. It doesn't. It just like it doesn't seem like it has any use for me right now. All right, let's go. No harm done. Let's go. Allons-y. No oh, shit. I need a bite. This motherfucker already. No! Miyoko! You fucking bitch! Damn fucking swarm. There we go. They're all dead. You fucking bitches. The fuck are you still doing on your knees? Fucking come on. Little bitch, follow me. Got ourselves a spaceship to chase after. Oh, look, one of the more, one of these fucking bitches. The, the I don't even know what the hell those things are. It's something that needs to die anyway. <laughs> I think my gun needs to repair. Got the stupid icon. Oh my chicken! Need to heal up. My ass is getting fucked right now. The bitch is in the grass. I don't. Even, where the hell is it? There you are. Oh my chickens. Come on, shoot it already. <laughs> wow, I was almost a death box just then. You alright? Both of you get your asses out, we're moving along. Oh wow, that's another one. I wouldn't use your ultimate ability on this motherfucker. I am a oh, Where's your other ultimate go. ability? This one right here. It, 
Is it dead? No, it didn't quite die. Now it's dead. Get some more health. Who oh, hit that one so hard it lost its legs? All right, you're dead. Uh, there's only a few more. All right, one more. There we go. They're all dead. Where the hell's my freaking companions? Put me down on their knees again. Oh, the ship was like right there. I must be blind. Open up. Anyone home? You go on ahead, Captain. Hey, I'm this guy's dead. Ships, even when they're in the best of shape. Necklace. Corporate yep. commander. We'll Keeping watch here. Eject Camel Eject the cap captain. Locate locate targeting ship. Run diagnostics. So look at that. The bridge controls are offline. The engines technically functional. Hull integrity, don't ask. Oh look at that. It's a death box. Start Mayday message playback. Oh yeah. Again and again, that without fixing our regulators, spinning up the engines are going to blow through our coils and we'll go flying off in a completely random direction. Well, here we are. Thinking we'll hit soil in. Congratulations. About you crashed. Seconds. This is your chief engineer signing off for what is probably the last time. It's a shame you can't see this metal finger I'm holding up because I'm doing it as hard as I can. Eject camion, the command key. Yeah, we got the command key. And now I guess I can go through the front door. Anyone home? I guess not, you're all dead. That's a shame. Don't mind me if I loot your shit. You won't need it anymore. There's the chip, and there's grab this. Good luck. That's the entire ship, though. Like it never happened. Being on this angle feels weird. It's like I'm walking on a wall or something. Where do we want me to go? I have to go to... I have to go back to Sanji. They want me to go back to the town that MSI owns. <laughs> oh wait, oh, other way. Damn thing put me on the bridge, facing the wrong direction. Whew. May have to repair my gun. Like there must be a perk to increase the the durability of that. Because it seems like you shoot, you barely shoot the thing and it's already half broken. Like, I shot my gun, I shot the gun probably like 50 times and it's already half broken. At least it's leveled up now. Having to spend money on a gun just to fix it.
What was it like in Edgewater? I hear you workers were on the clock every available moment. All right, here you go. If Here's the iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I've sent patrols, but they're running into trouble with the iconoclasts. How the hell could the iconoclasts still be... Could you agree to a truce with the iconoclasts? They're all mad. And what's more, they left us. I don't see any way for us to work together. I've read your review, Sanjara. You can't do this alone. Uh, not this again. Remember what we practiced, sir. Yes. Remember. The words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a mantipiller. And my will is my cocoon. I can emerge and become whatever Classic. I wish. You're good with the details, but you could use someone that sees the bigger picture. You too? He has a point, sir. And it's not all bad. Supposing you're right, who exactly would you have me work with? The iconoclasts are not the most compromising sorts. Well, Graham is dead, along with his second, maybe you could take charge. I'm afraid not. Most of them left Stellar Bay under some notion that any corporate organization was tyranny. If their leadership is gone, there'll be no controlling them. I don't think there's anything we can do. But it was a good effort on your part. Yeah, I totally killed those motherfuckers. They gave me some shitty mission I didn't want to do, so I shot the guy the moment the conversation ended. Better luck next time, I guess. Well, because the module controls the weapon systems. I mean, why do you need the gunship's weapon systems? Because once we mount them on Stellar Bay's walls, no Marauder or Raptodon will ever be a threat to us again. Hmm. Stellar Bay will be as secure as any other settlement in Halcyon. If you say so. The point is... This weapon system would be a powerful advantage, oh, yeah? and we can't risk the Iconoclast getting it. Unlimited power. I don't see how the UDL is going to let you keep their toys. The board's own salvage and recovery clause 32B would say differently. And they won't dare challenge us over this. Not after the data you found on their experiments here. You mean the ligma they had up in that cage? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Don't worry. We'll send an engineering team for those later. We'll have to disconnect them from the rest of the ship. Of course, they'll be useless without that targeting module, which is why it's critical that you retrieve it. We're just like stringing this guy along. It's just like, keep on talking, keep on talking. And then which I'll eventually give you the ship. The iconoclast get them. Seems like your people should be able to handle this. Look, Celia. He's being funny again. I don't think so, sir. Really? I, I could have sworn... Well, well, that's not important. What is important is that there's a considerable distance between us and that ship. <laughs> and most of it is inhabited by marauders and raptodons. Use, use, use chicken. Enough about the gunship. Good, because we haven't a moment to lose. According to the ship's log, they suffered some, some kind of malfunction. That's surprising. The board's equipment is usually in top shape. After all, they have first access to any fresh parts or components. Everyone gets careless. If there's anyone I wouldn't expect a slip like this from, it's UDL. Oh, here you go. All the conversations are finished. Let's just give you the damn targeting module now. It's all yours. Excellent. At last, we have what we need. That was an optional thing. I wouldn't get excited thing. just yet, sir. It looks like the iconoclasts followed you. I have word they're gathering in the ruins outside of town. Really? Fucking bitches. Ooh, I just got goosebumps. You really know how to sell that, don't you? Maybe you could, uh, teach me how you do that. Um, Sir, you just point a gun and fucking shoot it? Right. I'll lock the south gate to keep them out. You'll have to approach from the north. Good luck. 
It's like, you would have thought that after killing all these Iconoclast bastards, you would have thought they would have given up by now. These motherfuckers never learn. I'm gonna have to kill all of them again. I hear those rich people in this What's this one? Damn. This thing's condition is like condition clash tag fucked right now. I'm gonna have to repair this bitch. There's 76 weapon parts. There we go. 26 years. Still got some spare. Alright, let's, uh, let's go see what we're up against over here. How many people have to die now? Classic. Well, there's a bunch of MSI troopers over there. Ooh. Smells like those old Sundays when we'd unload salt tuna shipments. Alright, follow these guys. You'll get used to it. Give it 10 or 15 years. Fuck you, bitch. Motherfucker. This guy's this guy is a real in a really shitty spot. Apparently you can't shoot through the railing. It's basically a headshot or nothing right there. Well they're gone. Oh, hello there. What in there? Oh my chicken! All right, come on, let me loot this bitch. Right in the balls. Uh, no more. No more Mr. Nice Guy. You're getting shot in the balls. All you iconoclast pieces of shit. Let's go. He's not dead. Oh, second ultimate then. There we go, you're finally dead. Oh, these guys are just cannon fodder. How the fuck are you still alive, bitch? What in the fuck? Whoa, what the fuck? Now that guy pulled some like matrix shit on me just then. All oh, the MSI guys are dead and so are the Iconoclasts. Who knew they even had this many guys left? I killed their entire encampment and they're still here. Let me guess, he's still on the bridge. Need some more Adreno.
No, they're still fighting over there. Auto mag pistol. That's just. That's just a shame. <laughs> yes! No, that's an MSI. They're on my team. It looks like everyone looks the damn same. They were wearing the same damn armor. It's basically a guy with a helmet on you're supposed to be killing right now. Damn, it's these rails again. That's a big ass bitch back there. The guy's got a fucking riot shield or some shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. I need a retreat. That was a close one. Go, go, go! Oh, fuck off! Wow. I didn't even see the guy charging up on me until the last second. He got a good hit in and I got fucked up. Whew! I'm gonna admit, that's a lot of guys for one handgun. Probably be even worse if I tried using my melee weapon. Because you have to get even closer. Some of those guys are using heavy weaponry. Even saw the guy with the riot shield coming towards me. Oh wow. I have to start the battle all over again. It, it only auto saved inside the city. Guess I'm killing all these guys again. Better luck next time. All right, let's go, MSI. Smells like those old Sundays when we'd unload Saltuna shipments at the cannon. Go, go, go! You'll get used to it. Give it 10 or 15 years. This guy. Oh my golly gosh! This guy right here. Oh, I got him through the rail that time. Amazing. Wait, that's an MSI. Alright, you're gone. Is that an MSI? Oh, my chickens. I don't guess there's a difference. One's wearing a helmet and it looks like the other one's wearing a hood. I missed that shot. Wow, the peace chief is still kind of weak to me. Oh shit. I need to heal up. You're telling me I have like a shit ton of ammo. Why does this gun suck so much? You even upgraded and it's still kind of crap. Oh wow. Just stick to the revolver. That wasn't worth it. Switch into the peacekeeper. Things are shit keeper. It's like occasionally you'll hit a 40 with that motherfucker, but 
It keeps on hitting damn threes. Stick to my revolver. That thing's hitting like up to three hundreds. What the hell? It actually... It actually quick saved this time. Last time it didn't. Here you have some heavy ammo. Guess this gun uses heavy. Two seventy six, two twelve. Down they go. Shoot that guy right there. He's the one with the freaking cannon. Seems like those shots are missing point blank range. How the hell did that guy get behind us? Hello? Light assault rifle mark 2. I'm gonna break it down. Another light assault rifle. All right, advance. Last time there was like a bunch of dead guys on the bridge. Have to break this shit down. Take some more a ammo. Break this down. Take some Adreno. Now this is the part where I died last time because there was a ton of guys here. No, oh, that guy just got vaporized. Are you an enemy? No, you're not. Oh, there's a guy up here, eh? Good luck. Ah, oh, shit, I hit him in the face. He fell over. Can I still get him from here? I'm gonna have to wait for him to stand up again. Everyone all right? There we go. Holy, holy, toffin free. Oh, this is the part. There's a bunch of guys over here. Damn, the liber. Huh. What the fuck? Oh. Let me get the, that guy right there. The one with the giant shield. Shoot the guy with the shield! Meanwhile, I have to get this bitch out of my face. Well, fuck. Oh, no way. Run! Get some cover. Oh, loop the fucker over here. Try to wait for my slowdown time shit to, like, regenerate. Legma. There we go. What the? Oh, this fucking heavy cannon motherfucker is still alive. Oh my! So I guess this thing's actually going through the shield. Not very well, though.
Get around behind you. Oh, it worked. Slow mo saves the day. Movement mechanism from a limb auto mechanic. Alrighty. See what I can loot. More re revolver mark too. So it shows you the person has loot sometimes, but then when you go to look at them and there's nothing there. Oh, there's guys inside this building. Hello? Oh shit. Ah. There we go. That's better. Let's go. Let's go. Better. Better. Oh, I just got clipped in the face just then. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm, just, I'm completely surrounded right now. No, fuck you. Monarch Abide won the Battle of Stella Bay. I guess they surrender. I killed enough of these fucking pricks that they surrendered. They're still looking for me. Yellow. <laughs> the ball shot always works. Shooting him in the head didn't seem to want to work, so shoot him in the cock instead. Advantage Mark Three helmet. Oh, apparently there's a guy still in here. In the butt. Grab your back here. And that's how it's done, Captain. That's a stim. Right gear. Uh, lock pick. Some ammo for a light gun. I have way too many of those. Energy cell. Marauder thud. Let's see what heavy weapons. You can actually pick that itself now. Oh, it's just saying I have the MSI armor. Good dialogue. Five for dialogue. Leadership. Let's do some leadership. There we go. A top hat. Lockpick. In the inferno site. Holy gaming with the host. I have to turn that up a bit. I can barely hear that.
No, apparently this guy is still shining up as blue, yet he's got no loot on him. Guess that's everybody. He basically just looped around the town and everyone's dead now. What do you think of the unreliable Parvati? There's always something to fix, and it's neat working in the Aether. <laughs> you like, yeah, you were on the ship longer than me. I really haven't spent much time on that damn ship. Senja, yay, we win. I am totally didn't do a fucking thing, but I'm gonna claim victory now. You ever been off Monarch, Mioka? Before you met the captain. I swear, you? Celia has more balls yeah, than this I'm guy. I'm just drinking. You're back. <laughs> and in one piece. <laughs> Does this mean you? I, I mean, we won? We did indeed, sir. I can't believe it. Not that I'm really surprised, but, well, maybe a little. You did it! I mean, we did it! You didn't kill no one. I hope they use this opportunity to make the most of things for Monarch. Oh, I certainly will. Between our reinstatement on the board and the gain of this ship, we'll usher in a new age of prosperity for the people of Monarch. I'm right glad to hear it, Mr. Sanjar. Folks around here could use a good turn. And perhaps in time, I can use my position on the board to turn things around for the rest of Halcyon. Sure, let me know how that goes. I shall. Perhaps I'll write you a brief. Anyhow, thank you. What did I get? Good luck to you. Just XP? Wait, I wanted to talk to you about something else. What can I do for you? How are things going in Stella Bay these days? Quite well, actually. It's astounding how much our quality of life has improved without Graham's lunatics breathing down our necks. Our residents are reporting increased productivity during their shifts oh. and improved satisfaction in their leisure time. And he gave me $750 real growth and a gun. To look forward to. That's nice. Let me have a look what gun it was. This bitch right here. Damn! It's a heavy weapon. Oh, why the hell does it always do that? It always goes for slot one instead of whatever the fuck I wanted again. Yeah, revolver. Oh my gosh. It put that in slot one instead of... They, re they really need to redo that. Like, you want to, like, move the weapon from slot one to slot three, but it goes to slot one. Right, I guess I'm gonna have to put it in that order then. Game's being damn weird. I'm gonna have to fix my stuff, those. Repair all. 25 weapon parts and 20 armor. I've got 73 and 77, so I've got enough. Mmm, scrap a come. Scrap some of this shit right here. Break down. Break down the flamethrower. Shock cannon. Grenade launcher, assault rifle, light assault rifle. Break this one down. A sniper rifle. Now what? Let's have a look what the map. Oh, journal. Radio. F oh, I have to speak to Phineas, the weird guy. I guess that we can move on to another planet. Because I've made MSI like me now. I guess that's what you came here to do. Then again, could you go either way? You could have wiped them both out. Save no one. Kill everybody. And be an all-round bad guy. 
Oh my. He literally got me stuck between you and the wall with then. Alright, fast travel. It wants me to go back to the ship. What's going on here? Okay. Wrap the dolls. Alright. Oh, this time I didn't actually put me directly on the ship. Alright, we have to get on the ship and we most likely have to take off from this planet. Because Phineas is on his own ship up in space somewhere. You just have to use the galaxy map, I think. But again, it's been a while since I've actually been on this thing, so I can't remember how all this works. Classic. <laughs> Warning, intruders will be... Oh, oh it's, you. it's you. Captain, I hope you made the right decision by siding with MSI. Yeah. Who doesn't want to side with Micro Star International? They make some pretty good motherboards. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? Oh wait, you're not the person. Know anything about that ultra mechanical gathering dust in the janitor's closet? The unit is a cleaning Sam. Hawthorne brought it on board some cycles ago, I'm sure with the intent to modify it. But I've never seen it up and running. Alex likely recorded progress notes detailing his efforts to modify Sam. If you check the terminal in your captain's quarters, we may be able to determine what work remains in order for Sam to properly operate. Okay. See Catch you, you soon, later, Captain. Captain. Oh, yeah. We have to go to the navigation terminal. Phineas. Apparently, I'm on Monarch right now. I have to fly all the way across the galaxy to, to Phineas's lab. We have successfully arrived at Phineas's orbital lab, Captain, mm. and we are still in one piece. Shall I congratulate myself, or would you like to do the honors? Does it really matter? Let me open up the fucking door and we're gonna go talk to this guy. Oh, my chickens. Phineas's improved science lab. <clears throat> Hello? Can Hello? you hear me? Does this work? Oh, damn it, blast, that's loud. I'm just securing my ongoing experiments. Good luck. And securing myself. Don't die. Mind the mess. Uh, I haven't had a visitor since... Uh, in fact, I've never had a visitor. Well, you're behind a plate of glass. Guess I have to use your intercom. Armored glass. Not bad, eh? I was just about to say. I'd clap you on the shoulder if I weren't behind a wall of bulletproof glass. I don't know how you did it, but Hiram Blythe just sent me everything I needed. According to Hiram's message, Minister Clark has ordered a suspicious uh, amount of dimethyl yeah. oxide. It's almost oh, as damn. if he's hoarding the colony's remaining supply. To 
typical elitist, hoarding supplies during a time of scarcity. Once I have those chemicals, we can revive the Hope's colonists and put some decent people in charge. Are you so, sure? Good news. You're going to Byzantium and stealing those chemicals. Exciting. Hooray, new planet. Just tell me what to do. Ah, yes, the details. I'm not about to ask you to rampage through Byzantium trading bullets with the board's agents. We'll have to resort to subterfuge. Ooh, sneaky, eh? She's my contact in Byzantium. Meet her at the docks. She'll have all the necessary intelligence you require. I'm giving you my old nav key to Byzantium. You'll need it to land in the Golden City. Remember, you're looking for dimethyl sulfoxide. Big green bubbling vessel with a warning label. I'll take as much as you can find. Warning label? Something about being discontinued due to severe adverse reactions. It's fine. You'll be stealing the chemicals, not ingesting them. Anything I should know about this common person? You can trust her if that's what you're asking. Imagawa is the finest special agent in Byzantium that money can buy. My money, anyway. Oh, yeah. Actually, there's something course, else I wanted to talk about. What's on your mind? Got a mo Is there any reason you're hiding behind bulletproof glass? Never know what being frozen did to your brain. There's always a chance you might turn violent. I've no desire to end up like Thompson. Regardless, oh, it's quite oh, yeah. here, you know. I have my beans, have my caffeinoids, plenty of toilet paper. He's behind bulletproof glass because of me. The hell is this guy? It's a pig. Press X to talk, nothing happens. Because it's a pig. What the hell is this? Pick up the poster. Cystoid pig. Bulletproof class. Ingenious. Shrink ray. Uh -huh. Interesting. Phineas Wells. Own shrink ray. Oh my gosh. Here's a plasma rifle. That's a pain in the ass, this inventory management shit. Peacekeeper can fuck off the. Or. Oh, oh, you know, I can just shoot this pig thing over here and try that. Oh. It only works the once, though. Interesting. How about you? He wouldn't let me shoot my own companion. Can't even hack it. Right, time to leave. That's pretty interesting, though. A shrink ray. Didn't shrink by much, but it makes them weaker, though. Stop damn yawning right now. You have acquired a poster. Welcome back. Do wipe the blood and space dust from your feet in the entry bay. Thank you. Welcome Thank you. back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? 
I'm in the mood for some entertainment. Certainly, Captain. What would you like to hear? Tell me, play my favorite song. Now playing a Spacer's Choice advertisement jingle. It's not the best choice. It's Spacer's Choice. That's not my favorite song. Everyone in Halcyon is contractually obligated to label this or another board certified jingle their favorite song. Well, fuck them then. As you wish, Captain. I must comply with all direct orders. Uh, my chickens. Goodbye. All right. Where's where's this? Oh, I have to go to Terror Two. No. Oh my gosh. I need to stop yawning already. We are now in orbit above Byzantium, Captain. Achievement unlocked. Paradise found. I understand we have decided to continue supporting the outlaw scientist, Dr. Phineas Wells. Yeah, don't worry. I'm gonna kill that guy. Maybe. Maybe? Still haven't decided. I'm sure he'll be he'll come out of his stupid bulletproof glass eventually. He even noticed me. I shot the glass and he mentioned it. I was like, bulletproof glass, marvelous, ain't it? Classic clues. What's this? Construction. Operational. Clearance? No thanks, don't need it. And there she is. Common. Do you mind? I'm meeting someone. Roll your eyes and sigh dramatically. I oh oh. You mean I'm supposed to be meeting you. Why do you sound so surprised? Nothing, it's just... I thought you'd be taller. Anyway, let's not get hung up on that. The Phoenix hey. is a wanted man and the board has eyes everywhere in Byzantium. The Phoenix? Yeah, that's my code name for... You know, our mutual friend. What's your code name? Oh. I'm Golden Eagle. Do I have a code name? Um, yeah. I named you Cuckoo. Cuckoo. That doesn't even make... Fine. Fine. Oh, oh, oh! Can I be chicken? Because chickens will adopt mm. any critter's baby and keep them warm. Chicken. You sure you don't want to be raven? Or sparrowhawk? Aww. Aww. Okay, okay. Chicken it is. Yay, chicken! This cloak and dagger stuff is nonsense, but if everyone else gets a code name, I want one too. You can be Cassowary. That's shockingly apt. We're named after Cassowaries birds. Cassowaries were though. a solitary bunch. But once they had a friend, Golden they'd stick Phoenix. with them till the end. Aggressive little creatures too. A Cassowary. Anyway, you're Wait, looking that's to the make birds that like Mr. try to fucking headbutt uh, you or something. Magpie, right? I should warn you, it won't be easy. This motherfuckers are aggressive. In this estate, which is heavily guarded. Cassowary motherfucker. How exactly did you get involved in this anyway? I've always been fascinated by birds. If you ever research Earth species, there are thousands of them. So colorful and distinct. Here we got Let's go. flavors of terror rays and not much else. That kind of variety? I mean... Gosh. Eleven flavors of impossible. ligma. All of them trying to eat you, I'd wager. The other thing about birds, though, is their environmental indicators. Meaning? When the birds start disappearing, you know something's a foul. No pun intended. Hey. <laughs> Enough with the birds. 
Fine. I started thinking about everything we see around Halcyon, and all the things we don't see. Like what? For starters, you rarely come across anyone living in Byzantium who wasn't born here, even though we get ships in all the time. Doesn't that seem strange to you? Not really. And then there's the way nothing gets fixed. There used to be a suggestion box around here. People would drop ideas in. Nothing ever came of them, of course. Seems pretty normal, actually. Sure, that part is. That's why they install shredders in those boxes, after all. But one day the shredder broke. No one came to fix it. And since it wasn't working, we didn't have anywhere to file our complaints. So you can hmm. imagine how messy things got. I bet your repair folks couldn't find parts. Back in Edgewater, I'd have to take something apart just to put another thing back together. Might have been the paperwork. Here, you have to append Ooh, forms to your forms, oh my gosh. and law help you if there's a single dash out of place. A regular tragedy. At first, management put up an out-of-order sign, but that just seemed to worry people, like they were advertising something wasn't working. They eventually took the whole suggestion box sign down so that people didn't have any expectations about it. But they never fixed it, never replaced it. Doesn't that seem odd to you? No. That's how things around Halston work, in case you didn't notice. Except that's not how they go. At least that's not how they're supposed to go in Byzantium. If things are broken here, of all places, then I'm starting to think there ain't a hope left in this colony. Things have kept on running this long, right? Or so I used to think. The whole episode made me wonder. If they can't fix something as simple no. as a suggestion box, what else aren't they fixing? After a while, I got connected with our mutual friend and started using my position here to feed him information when I could. That's it, really. Can't get me into the minister's estate? Whoa, I'm not one of your B&E specialists. I just provide intelligence. Okay, what's what can you tell me? Some of the guards hang around Billingsley's house of inebriation between shifts. Oh. House of inebriation? Count me the hell in. Maybe you could do some reconnaissance there. You know, swipe a key while nobody's looking. Uh, oh my gosh! Thanks for the tip. Just remember, you didn't hear it from me. Looks like I've got work to do. Good hunting, Golden Eagle. Yes. Let's go. Workbench just quit. Oh, oh, oh. The workbench. Pick. Oh, this is like. It's a lock pick, but you don't. Easy. Don't even use a lock. You, you don't even use a lock pick on it, though. You have to pick it without using a lock pick. Who are you? So what of those MSI? Move along. Nothing exciting ever happens around here. I'm MSI, bitch. What are you gonna do about it? Corporate asshole. That. It's not gonna fix itself. Don't we have repair drones for that kind of thing? This was a repair drone. Oh, bro broken things. That's nice. Oh, here's the damn the workbench is right here. Let's try to tinker on this. Oh, where is it? The MSI. It's a level 18. This thing's in the level nine. Increase the damage by two points. Yeah. Oh my fucking gosh. Why am I so damn tired right now? Hey, you. You must think you're pretty tough. I bet I could take you. No, you can't. I can slow down time, motherfucker.
Retirees. <laughs> I wonder if I'll get It's to meet a bunch Chairman of Rockwell. old people. Corporate troopers. So what if all those em nothing exciting ever happens around here? Requires terminal type oh, I need to find a code, eh? Pick up a toss ball. Don't even have enough luck. I need more lockpick skill than that one over there. Sealed. Oh, open the fucking door then. Move along. Are you the L security attendant? Oh. Nope. I guess I have to grab the other door. That one's locked as well. How the hell do I get out of here then? Must have to go down a different path. Oh, there's an elevator. That explains a lot. Do -do -do -do. Right, nice trip. Now we're up on the the. Well, now we're on planet side. Uh, why can't something? An ad drone. Janitor. It looks like everything is a. It looks like it's a bunch. Hello. You got presents. Natural magnetism. Know what I mean? Your name's Maverick. What if you're selling? I'm not buying. There's those street smarts. Just the right amount of rough around the edges. Next time, we'll have you say that over the rim of a tripper stout. Product placement, baby. Listen, uh, you got an agent? Some kind of representation? Oh my fuck! Gosh, I consider my a free freelancer. Fresh natural talent. I know it when I see it. Listen, you got a real special quality, raw energy. I see you in pictures, kid. Just tell me what you're offering. I'm making a feature, Space Pirates of Moros Prime. It's gonna be a hit. But we still need a star. And I think you got the chops. Hey, if you want an action story, you ought to haul a couple of cameras to Monarch sometime. We'll give you some damn good footage. If you survive. Unscripted chaos. Come on, who'll pay to see that? Audiences want heroes and villains just like the one standing in front of me. So what do you say? You ready for the chance of a lifetime? Hey! All right. Terrific. Logan I guess I'll take your studio. stupid quest. Head if I don't, if I, I decide I don't do it, it happens. You're going I just all don't the way do it. to the top, baby. Take comfort in knowing that anything antibiotics cannot stop will probably kill you quickly. Eh, antibiotics, anti ligma pills. Is that supposed to be a model of the system? Not super accurate. Ugh. Decadence ain't gonna save you when beasts chew through the walls. The system. CNP Borst Pocket can be macroed in two and a half seconds. Hey, hey, Borst hey, Dro. Get out of my face. Oh my gosh, why the fuck am I so tired right now? I've yawned like 20 fucking times in the last 20 minutes now. I've always loved this. Need to stop being a bitch. You with the hips over here. Let me Whoa. take a closer look at you. Wow. Uh, it went off by accident. Luckily, you didn't get triggered by me hitting a wall. Uh uh uh. Uh uh uh. Just... Hold that posture for a moment while I admire you. You have a natural contraposto, my dear. The way you rest your weight against your hip suggests a certain rugged charisma possessed Lick only by balls. the mighty primal and the well-traveled spacer. Splendid. Need I some love more it. Zeus chicken. That's me, rugged and well-traveled. Ah, oh, Celeste, you've done it again. I knew from the moment I laid eyes on you that I'd found my muse. I'm Celeste Jolicoeur. 
And you, my dear, are exactly what Byzantine needs. Where is the pull trigger halfway through the fuck? It's like you read my mind. Darling, you and that brutish swagger of yours have been on my mind the moment you stepped into my studio. I'm oh, working on a new yeah. line of clothing that will shock this city to its core, and I'd like your help. What do you say, my dear? You want <clears throat> to make history with me? Good luck. Don't die. You got a pretty high opinion of someone you just met. Everything I need to know can be deduced from a first impression. You're an outsider. You're exotic. You carry a whiff of barbarism and adventure. You're the embodiment of everything I want in my new line. Oh, yeah. What do you have in mind? When I look at you, I see the very embodiment of everything the walls of Byzantium were built to keep out. Making an outfit worthy of you won't be easy. I'll need your help gathering the right materials. Okay. I'll help you out. Marvelous! You and I are going to wake this city up like a cold splash of wine to the face! What I need is a survey of the outside world. What does the common laborer wear? How do the wild-eyed madmen of Monarch dress themselves? I've heard rumors, but I require samples. I'm really not sure. Also, I expect you to model for me. Any excuse to admire my looks, huh? Can't blame you. Oh, you can You'll be the talk of Byzantium once I'm done with you. I'll need you to model for me the following. The apparel of an iconoclast, the armor of a marauder, and a full ensemble of spacer gear. Oh. Helmet included. And when I say spacer gear, I mean an outfit worn by real spacers. None of that garbage spacers choice pedals. You Why have didn't the know? bearing what? and demeanor of a born model. You're going to absolutely murder this job. You, I uh, really won't surprise you if I fucking murder you first, though. Fabulous! I can't wait to see what you dredge up. Where am I supposed to find this shit? If I were an enterprising spacer in need of a wardrobe, I'd probably head to the Groundbreaker. You want me to model these fucking clothes, but you're telling me you don't even have them on you? Well, fuck you then, bitch. I love Byzantium. Let's move on from this and go into this the bar. Talk to Dr. Ligma over here. Hey, 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 stand hey. back. You. I'm part of Minister Clark's personal detail, and that means you. Yeah. Time back. No times. You get out of my face, you son of a bitch. Didn't know I was talking to such a big shot. Yep, you're looking at the minister's newest personal guard. <laughs> right here. The others took me out to celebrate on account of me just getting hired. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sounds about right. Anything you could tell me about Minister Clack? Oh, um, he's a uh, medium. Height with like medium colored hair and like a kind of a medium face. Just like in his posters. You haven't actually met him, have you? Everyone tells me he's very private, okay? Besides, I just started. I'll leave you to it, bitch. Hey, you look familiar. Have we met before? I literally just finished talking to you. He's basically the most important person in the colony, which makes me the most important guard in the colony. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. That means I got a key to the minister's estate, my own personal UDL assist issued shotgun. <laughs> they don't give those out to just anyone. <laughs> oh, yeah. Congratulations! Yep, I've nearly made it to the top, my friend. 
I'm just two promotions away from on-the-job bathroom breaks. Wow! That's a great idea! I'll have a Spectrum vodka. Captain, I can smell him from clear over here. I reckon he's had a fair number already. Sure have, because today <laughs> is my big day. Yeah, my you fucking and get pissed. You, uh, you have a, <laughs> for a new pal? Oh, this guy's fucked. He's already sloshed. Cheers to me. <laughs> hey, you're really great. Have I told you that? We should be friends. <laughs> wow, listen to me. I'm soaked. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I was down on the tile somewhere. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I could, I could have another. You got another? Here we go. Oh, maybe they got some at the bar. Okay. Hey, bartender. Bar, bar fucking tender. Have you tried our new cocktail sponsored by Riz? Shut the fuck up. I need a drink. Then you'll want to speak with our auto mechanical inebriation assistant. Located what the just fuck does there. that even mean? Aren't you the bartender, but bitch? I would never lower myself to do something as gauche as tending bar. My auto mechanical assistant does all the work for me. Wow! I mean, I have to talk to a vending machine? Where the hell is that? This guy right here. Please allow me to improve your drinking experience with fine cocktails and pre-approved banter. I'll have a drink, thank you. Panties with the rehost, eh? Mechanical... Uh, wait, I've never actually been to a vendor before. What did this guy want again? Oh yeah, Spectrum Vodka. Let's, let's just buy all of them. Get this ghost get this guy so shit faced he can't even walk. Hey, you look familiar. Have we met before? Offer him another drink. It's not every day you get your dream job, right? Wow! You got like this crazy energy. You want another one? Has anyone ever told you that? You're like a You gotta a drink a whole you got a fifty bottle off of this shit. Oh, laws. I gotta stop. I'm seeing at least two of you. Drink another Only one. Only two? You've got a ways to go. Have you always been here? I didn't see you a minute ago. <laughs> here, have another one. I really shouldn't. I'll have the worst Take another one. It's, I'm not stop. offering. It's a demand. You sure sound like you know what you're talking about. Okay, here goes. <laughs> here we go. Was that one supposed to taste like purple berry crunch? Or am I just tasting breakfast? I don't feel so good. I think I'm going to be sick. All right. Follow him to the bathroom and assassinate. All right. What the hell? Is this guy dead? He just like fell unconscious. Oh, there we go. Let's go speak to Minister Clark. Remember that stranger I saw? Wait, how do you get over there? You have to climb the ladder or something. Ah! Ouch, that hurt.
restricted area, right? Unauthorized personnel in restricted areas will be shot on site without question. You can either fight, sneak, or use holographic shroud. Post-mortem fines will be paid to the closest living relative. So if they kill you... <laughs> So if they kill you, they make the, the, your closest living relative pay the fine. <laughs> That's funny. Like, oh, I killed you, you. Your father got killed, so now you're gonna have to pay the fine. Oh. The guy still sees me there. What? Oh my golly gosh. <laughs> oh oh. Fuck the board. Ah. Oh, they're going guns blazing in this motherfucker now. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the board. Oh shit, son. Anybody else? Oh, wait, there was Rainer with the host as well. Oh my chickens. They turned from a stealth mission to like shoot 'em up very quickly. Oh, Missed. Hopefully, they didn't alert anybody else. Officer spine. Let me, like, take your sword and make it into some scrap. Let's go sneak. Looks like they're all on the right hand side. Uh, 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 I didn't see shit. Need to back up. Oh, what is this gun? Yeah, whatever it is, it's melting these guys. It's like a flamethrower type thing. Reloading! Right here. Oh, come on, let me break it down. Don't need it anymore. Hello? Nice How did to you meet get you. In here? You! You just slaughtered those guards, and for what? To speak with me? What could possibly be so urgent? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, my law. Captain! Captain! That's the minister! Mr. Clark! Oh, wow! If this is about another Aether Wave clip or radio spot, you may kindly fuck off, as the parlance goes. I'm not doing any more. The hell is making the dogs go ape shit right now. Cut the shit. I'm here for some whatever the fuck that word is again. Drugs. Something scientifically ligma. I don't have any drugs. You should try a vending machine or a purveyor of curative goods. He's got no idea what we're asking about. All right. Will that be all, then? Why do you keep talking like that? Stars, they're getting denser by the day. I shall endeavor to speak more slowly. Is this better? No. Slower and louder and into my good ear. What's, was that a joke? Sarcasm, even? Oh, this is such a relief. 
You've no idea how long it's been since I spoke with someone intelligent enough for irony. What's going on here? Chairman Rockwell. He's kept me under house arrest for years. I've long suspected him of transacting business in my name. But this proves it. You've been all alone what in this house? What the heck was that? Would, would you like me to make you tea? Let's go. Please. This is important. Whatever it is that brought you here, Rockwell's the one behind it. So I gotta go see Rockwell now? Then I'll have to deal with him. Whatever Rockwell's doing, he'll be doing it from the HHC headquarters. Your best lead is to look for details in his office. This all feels off, Captain. Like when there's a storm coming, but everything's quiet and still. Believe me, things have been off around here for a very, very long time. A reckoning is most certainly due. What the fuck, dog? This colony's problems have always seemed to trickle down from the top. If we're set on fixing Halcyon, that's as good a place as any to start. Exactly. And fix it we must. Why, this is starting to sound like an issue of Dissident Hunter. I don't know it. Where do I have to go to find this HHC headquarters? Halcyon Holdings Corporation, the collective of companies that run the colony together. Allegedly in partnership with the Earth Directorate and appointed Minister of Earth. Oh. Let's focus. How do I get there? Via the Acropolis District, of course. That's where the most important corporate and government facilities are. Sorry about but your dead gods, though. employees are allowed into the district. I tried to be There's sneaky and shit, but they just, just got in the way. Street. There might be a route through the maintenance tunnels, but I'm afraid I don't know specifics. Most people avoid the area for obvious reasons. If you guards don't scam me, I totally just killed all of yours. That's good, because there are sure to be more at headquarters. When you reach the HHC building, this access card should get you up to the executive suites, where the chairman's office and what Oh, so you just give me your executive card. Thanks. Office. I'll be on my way then. Wait. Brockwell has one of the only terminals capable of transmitting to the earthbound message drone. This is our chance. Please, take this and transmit it from his office. Brockwell hasn't given me any messages from Earth for years. He's desperate to keep me out of contact with the Earth Directorate. But they need to know what's happening here. Yeah. No promises. What's on the cartridge? What isn't on it is the real question. I've gathered meeting minutes, internal messages, sustainability reports, and more. All exposing the corruption and mismanagement plaguing Damn. Halcyon. Once the rest of the Earth Directorate sees it, they'll have to send help. But they wouldn't get here for... I don't even know. Shouldn't we do something our own selves? It's worth a try, but the Earth Directorate still needs that I don't even know how far away message. Earth even is we from must this hope galaxy. For their intervention. Good plan. Perhaps there is hope after all. And now I entrust it to you. Good luck, and trust no one in the Acropolis District. Trust no one. What a pleasure. I haven't had this much company in quite... Let me get this straight. The chairman is keeping you under house arrest. Haven't you heard? Chairman Rockwell and I are on a goodwill tour of the colony as we speak. It's too bad you're stuck here. It's quite all right. I've got every back issue of Dissident Hunter to keep me company. All right, I'll leave you be. Well, like, you're literally standing in front of a camera. Hope you don't mind me stealing this shit right here. Nice. No, he didn't even give a fuck. He's triggered Bob went up, then he's just like, nah. It's not worth it. I'm gonna end up like all these dead guards over here. Still in the restricted zone. There was a couple of guys outside when I came here. Might have to kill those guys as well. Let them know I'm still around. Went all sneaky since I have a silencer on my, my handgun.
<clears throat> Let's go. Wait a second. I went out the front door. It's not even in the restricted area anymore. This, bro this ultimatum brought to you by Universe. What the hell? A guard's just standing in front. Of oh, never mind. Oh, apparently I have to go to the chairman's office. It's just like right down the street. Is it me, or could each of these homes fit all of Edgewater's? Cannery and all. The Acropolis district is off limits. Oh, Move bitch. Along. If I'm not looking for trouble, I just want in. Yeah, and I'd really like a new Hammersmith grenade launcher. Hammersmith, the most trusted brand in brutality. But we can't all have what we want. And seeing as you don't seem yeah. the executive sort, you obviously don't yeah, I'm gonna kill in the you. Acropolis district. I really don't have time for yeah? this. Well, my shift ends approximately never, so I've got all the time in the world. Anyway, I've worked here long enough to know every clerk by name and face. And since I don't know yours, you ain't getting through. I've got a Hammersmith grenade launcher and it's yours if you let me through. Really? In that case, I'll take it off your hands. In the interest of public safety, of course. Did I say restricted area? Slip of the tongue. What I meant was, welcome to the Acropolis District. Wait, I really had a grenade launcher? What the fuck? Oh, thanks. Restricted oh. access. What are you owing and iring about? That I just talked my way through a checkpoint? Didn't even know I had a grenade launcher on me there. I guess I, I killed some guy with a grenade launcher at one point. Been carrying it the thing this entire time. Beatrice Reinhardt. I'm not sure talk to her. Ever in my Hello, receptionist. Life, more out of place than I do at this moment. Corporation board. Today's greeting is brought to you by Anti Clio, a subsidiary of Colway Pharmaceuticals. Oh. Today's greeting is brought to you by. Are you going to say the same damn thing again? A subsidiary of Colway Pharmaceuticals. State your business. State your business? Please step away. This entry is for high priority HHC business only. Is this official enough for you? Huh. I didn't realize we were still using those iridescent stickers. But this looks right. I'll just need you to register your weapons with a revised request to carry 32B form. Each weapon will need a separate form. That's ridiculous. It's procedure. Now, let's see. Damn it. When did I run out of forms? <laughs> oh, what a shame. You don't have to be sarcastic about it. Look, you don't have time to wait on new forms. And I can't afford the citations for impeding HAC business. So I'm going to save us both some trouble and waive your forms. Yay! Just know there are a bunch of guards upstairs, and they're all high on dervish mist and low on patience. So try anything funny, and they'll paint the walls with your guts. Good luck. I've basically killed everybody I've faced in this game so far. What do you even have? You have 600 health. These guys are level 19 though, so they might pose a threat. No elevator music? Well, this is a depressing ride to the top of the tower. Alright, that's the end of the trip. I'm here to see your boss, first of all. Apologies for the wait. I was arranging my stationery. What exactly do you do here? Personal assistant to Adjutant Akande and Chairman Rockwell. 
I'm also responsible for organizing the adjutant's stationery, which is more of a hobby. Any chance I could meet the chairman? Ah. Oh, you were being serious. I'm obliged to inform you that Chairman Rockwell is unavailable for an indeterminate duration. Will there be anything else? Um, I need to see him right now. What are you? Level 19. Can't tell what gun that is. What is... These guys have... A two-handed melee weapon. These guys are all late. Excuse me, just a moment. What the fuck do you want? Is there something I can do for you? I beg your pardon, Minister Clark's former office is currently closed to solicitors. I won't be long. I'm just admiring the architecture. I suppose that is admissible. Please try not to break anything. Wow, you're believing me. Oh, close the door. Don't want to let all the legma out of the room. No, oh, what the hell? The thing just opened up again. This, this shit must be automatic. Excuse me. You could dismantle a single room of this place, sell the materials, and feed everyone on Monarch for a month. Pack of cigarettes. Use the terminal. View priority message. Print ministerial key card. Boop. Good afternoon. I'm Chairman Rockwell. And I'm here to address a serious issue facing us. As you all know, our colony has been successful beyond our wildest dreams. Unfortunately, we've recently discovered that our food supply will not be able to sustain Halcyon's population in the long term. Everyone, Everyone will, die. will die. Everyone will slowly stop living from malnutrition. <laughs> Make it sound better. That's what matters. I fucking swear, if someone doesn't give me something to read, We'll placate the masses soon. All of you will find yourselves violently unemployed. But I can assure you there's nothing to fear. We've got a solution. It's called the Lifetime Employment Program. We will freeze most of the colony to preserve resources. Oh, while the yeah. best and brightest of Byzantium continue living in prosperity. Look, so you're idiots. saying that all the smartest people are the ones that are not. Like that. Fire whoever wrote this. While Halcyon's <laughs> brightest minds solve the problem this shit's of our funny. nutritional shortage, the rest of the colony will be placed in suspended animation. Individuals will be revived on a rotating basis so that every Halcyonite can be part of the important work of saving our colony. By testing paperweights. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> couldn't resist. Let, let's go again. And someday, in the not-too-distant future, when we've solved this crisis, we'll all be back together again, working for the good of Halcyon. Until then, the board shall provide for the deserving just as it always has. So, obey your supervisors, take your vitamins, follow your corporate-mandated grooming rituals, and rest assured with the board on your side, there is nothing to worry about. Good luck. Don't stop. That was all a story. Oh, look at that. It? Achievement unlocked. It's not real. The audience gasps. Guess the whole colony's Learn the thing. shocking truth I about the colony. That they're running out of food. <laughs> Send Minister Clark's message to Earth. Message on route. Please allow between three and nine months for your message to complete transit. Personal files. Personal file. The food reserve. Other corporations. Well, that guy's not here. Guy's door's locked. 
It's just great that there's having to be a massive hole in the wall where this guy's office used to be. How may I be of assistance? Mm, I don't need your assistance anymore. Well, that was a perfect stealth mission. I lied my way straight through the front door. Didn't even have to kill anybody that time. Apparently the chemicals are in this direction. Holly Gaming with the auto host. Oh yeah. Baggage check. Alright. Let's go. Yeah, those guys were a bit higher level length for me anyway. I might have killed one of those guys, but to be honest, those things are level 19. I swear my character's only like level 12. Unless you aim for the head with every shot. Or the balls. <laughs> those, those are pretty good. You make the person get crippled over. I think there's an achievement tied that as well. Wow. Let me have a look. Poor sportsmanship. There it is. You have to hit someone in the groin 20, 30 times. While using the slow motion thing. Oh wait. I'm going the wrong way. I'm still in the restricted zone, though. Is this house off limits as well? Let's see. If I go through the front door in this guard shooting, then I'm obviously in a restricted area. Oh, what's, what's the time? Ew. It's almost 9 o'clock. I'll try and get this half finished and then I um, might li most likely go play some Apex or something. Corporate Commanders. What level are you? Level 19. An elite corporate unit that wears heavy armor and pushes clo in close with a shotgun. Oh, so those guys have shotguns. Now this is... Hey, did Tillman get transferred? No. That was the side room. No, I found a bathroom just then. Shit must be downstairs. What the fuck? Oh, it's in restricted access. Basically, if you don't work here, or for Chairman Rockwell himself, you're not getting in. Show him Chairman's keycard. How's this for clearance? I don't know how you got that, but I still don't know you, and I don't have any new clearances on the list. Really? So, I'm basically having to kill people in this house now. How about you? What are you? Medium armor uses a rifle, and he uses a switch to one-handed weapon. You motherfucker! Holy shit! The guys with the shotgun fucked me up. 
Let's hope it didn't take me back too far. Let's hope it actually auto-saved when I entered the building. Otherwise, I'm going back a far way. Yeah, it's like, damn. Even with a fucking revolver, that guy took more than one shot to take down. It was the guy with the shotgun, though. My health was just gone like that. I don't even think the guy, the guy on the floor didn't even get me, it was the guy with the shotgun. Oh, I'm outside. I have to go through the door again. Classic. Okay. There. Yeah. It was this guy. Hey, Mr. Shotgun. Got it. Heads down. Mr. Sneaky. Did you really see me do that? What the fuck? Get out of the way, Provider. Unless you think you can kill this guy. got vaporized. What the hell just opened up then? Stupid computer just opens up some bullshit. There we go. I found myself an ID card so I can go to a restricted area now. Hey. No. Corporate commander. Oh, it's the guys upstairs. No harm done. Oh, what the fuck? There's a bunch of guys in that building. No prisoners. Legma. Off with your head. Yeah, have have a nice trip. Oh, my chickens! Ho <laughs> oh. Achievement unlock. The Destroyer of World. Had a maximum nev negative reputation on three refactions there. Oh, the board completely hates me now. Oh, that's fun. Or I guess we're killing everybody. Hey, receptionist! You're dead as well. Enjoy your trip. Turned you into a pile of ash on the ground. My scythe ain't messing around. <laughs> Get here. Stop running, make it easier on me. Fuck the board. 
<laughs> Psychopath. Where did the other one go? Oh, hello there. Hello there! Had enough chop chop time. Let's just. Come on. Damn it. You're making me waste ammo because I cannot shoot someone hip firing. There we go. Damn. Trespassers will be shot and fined. Disguise fail. Yeah, I don't think this guy's really matters anymore. even have enough hacking skill for your damn computer terminal. Could have went better. Reload. Now it really doesn't matter. The board completely hates me. Oh wow. We're, we're using a hologram to make our dis instead of disguise right there. We're looking like the guards. As long as we stand still, it doesn't change our disguise. Oh, we both look like these guys. <laughs> That's pretty interesting. But not that there's any guards left. I killed everybody already. Wait, what the hell? This door must be taking its time. There we go. We no longer need the disguise, we made it to the elevator. Hello? Here we go! Kill them. Covering you. Completely missed. Corporate commander can corporate ligma balls. Anybody else? How many more guards have you got? Or I have to kill everybody. Nice hit. Got a bunch of drones up in this bitch. There's a couple of guards there. Nice one. I'm getting hit pretty hard though. I'm gonna have to heal up with this one. I think I got a concussion. Cause my shit's all like blurry and stuff right now. Oh my god. They actually got me. Guess my heels didn't go up high enough. Whew. 
Also, it didn't take me back too far. Otherwise, I'm going to have to kill everybody in the damn building again. Oh. We're back at the elevator. What do you think you're doing? Whatever I want. What the hell? I thought I killed everybody. The moment I come out of the save, there's someone still alive again. And they're asking questions. What are you doing? How about no? Let the record show that subject 23K's cause of death is cerebral vascular. Lab Central. I'm gonna have to find this shit. Animal testing. Something you need? Um, I didn't want to talk to you. Keep him quiet, Gabby. I guess our disguise is, is blown. I'm gonna have to shoot our way through soon. Don't turn around. Let's hope I actually go in the right way. What do you think you're doing? Whatever I want. Oh, I, I guess, uh, never mind then. <laughs> the scientist is a bitch. Hibernation lab. Eventually get there. Hey, corporate commando. Soldier. God oh, damn, I don't have a lockpick ability to get through that door. And apparently, I can't jump over the railing. Fuck only. you. You're not supposed to be here, are you? Wow, oh, yeah, I am. I knew it! Huh? Here they this come! This might be tough! Open fire! Open fire! What the fuck? I beat that bitch ass down. Luckily he was the only witness. Take these take the stairs. Oh, there's a ton of guys in this room. How about this door? There we go. That's the thing I'm looking for right there. Ah! Ow! Yeah, heal up. Can't take a shot this time.
transfer a hundred percent. Oh, look at that. I went and killed everybody in the stupid pods. There we go. No hard feelings, death boxes. Alright, back up the elevator we go. Perfect height. Almost two hours in. Now we can go past the bar door. Oh <laughs> yeah, I forgot. I remember that. All these people are death boxes. Apparently there's one more guy around here somewhere. How about you? They must be old. They must be upstairs. Apparently, they're still hostiles. Here I go. Nice hit. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> I have no problem in killing civilians. Especially since the board hates you, it doesn't matter. It's just the casualty of Ligma Warfare. Right, now we have to go back to the ship and give this stuff to the crazy scientist guy. And then I'm probably going to end the stream there. Get some Apex in me. Oh shit. The corporate troopers are hostile towards me. Who would have thunk? Alright, I need to fix my weapons. Repair all equipment. Let me get myself a sniper rifle. Got them. Well, that was recoily. Bitch! <laughs> the gardener just decides like, doesn't give a fuck. I'm gonna reload my DMR. Where fuck? <laughs> Hiding behind a pot plant there. Oh, my chicken. The bullet literally whizzes straight past their heads. Oh, 
<laughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? Wow! I leveled up from killing civilians. Plasma weakness. Fuck off with your shit. Stop trying to give me shitty perks I don't want. Oh, that was the bitch you gave the grenade launcher to. Well, thanks thanks for the refund. You're just like one of those fucking prostitutes from Grand Theft Auto. You hand them an item and then take it back. How about you? Oh, you're dead. Good luck. Oh, this whole motherfucking city is hostile towards me. You're not hostile. You're not hostile. The fucking guards are, though. I'm ready to talk. Oh my god. I need to get rid of the damn drones. What the fuck, bitch? That civilian just tried to fuck my ass. Drone, fuck off, would you? Oh, my chickens! <sighs> what was that? Whatever it was, it took my health away really quickly. I think I got hit by a grenade launcher. Yeah, if I knew making enemies with the board would have made it this fucking hard to get out of town. It was corporate bullshit, though. You had to lie your way past guards, though. And I just don't have enough speech level to do it. So I gotta let my guns do the talking. Oh, my... I have to shoot my way past all the guards outside again. We'll eventually get there. Uh, probably have to re-equip my DMR though. Unless I go this thing. Burn, bitch. It worked up to a certain point, but I swear it's just like these heavy weapons have a drawback. You're like basically melting the person, next thing it feels like it's doing nothing to them. It's like, so far my best weapon seems to be that revolver. It's the most reliable one anyway. Sure, you sometimes miss, miss a freaking point-blank range shot, but... The thing seems to be the most consistent at doing damage, so... Hit like a hundreds, three hundreds, hundred and fifties, that kind of shit.
Well, let's try again. We'll eventually get ourselves off the planet to see that Phineas guy, and then we can... Make a merry way over to Apex. Before I probably fall asleep. In a few hours time. Because, I know, I'm mighty tired for some reason. What was that? What did I even unequip? Oh, the shrink ray. Got it. Kill Captain Cockerel. For the bloody of the fuck! What the hell? I'm stuck behind some random shit. Kill this motherfucker right here. What the fuck, gun? Fuck's sake. What stupid bitch? Today marks a monumentous occasion. Go fuck yourself. Bitch. Fuckers. Oh my god! I think I soiled myself. The fucking gods are you piece of shit. How the fuck do you get off this kind of a rock? Well, I see my damn ship, but I have to get fuck back down there again. Uh, you pussies! Gotta reload. <laughs> oh, bitch. You fucking piece of shit. How the fuck do I get down there? Oh, this bitch right here. Fucking elevator. I swear sometimes I'm stupid as fuck. <laughs> it's like, I don't fuck what you down there, boy! And then he's like, the elevator is right behind you. It's like, whew! You don't want to have to ever come back here again. There's more gods down here as well. What level is this motherfucker? Enjoy your death box. Piece of shit. Repair everything. Oh, those two guys over there. Down they go. 
Lock and load. Yeah, you're dead. Maybe not. You're a robot. You don't give a shit if I shoot you. You're just XP to me. Alright, let's get back on my damn ship and get the fuck out of this stupid ass planet. Because the board can totally lick my balls now. Oh my gosh. There we go, we're on the ship. Uh, let, let the people on the planet, like, calm down for a bit before I come back here. Unless they're always going to be hostile because this is a bored planet. Colony, whatever. The board completely hates me. Got, like, negative against, like, three colonies so far. That one had way, way more people than the last two colonies I completely wiped out, though. Where are we headed today, Captain? The stars are the limit. We're heading back to... Phineas. If you don't mind my saying, you have a message from Adjutant Sophia Akande. No one ever looks quite the same in person as they do in my reports. And my reports of you have been exceptionally thorough. You've had quite a career. Oh ho 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 ho! I got myself the attention of some motherfucking bounty hunter now. Let's skip the pleasantries, bitch. You have something I want. I'd like to negotiate. You people need better security. Anyone could have lifted those chemicals. Yes, I'm aware that you stole a batch of precious chemicals and destroyed an important experiment. Enterprising of you. If irritating. My scientists tell me they'll restore the damage you've done within a matter of months. But I'm not here to talk about minor setbacks. Phineas Wells is wanted by the board. I want to convince you to turn him in to us. Wanted for what exactly? He has a litany of charges against him. Vandalism, illegal experimentation, sedition. I could go on. Wells is a dangerous madman. His plan is going to endanger everyone in Halcyon. He's an obsessive psychopath. And he's using you. You're in contact with Wells. I want you to send us a tracing signal from his communication terminal. Hold on, I'm getting a lot of noise from this signal. Could you fuck off and never call back? You are making a serious mistake. Adjutant Akande's call has been terminated. Will there be anything else, Captain? <laughs> fuck you, agitator slut. Let's go back to Phineas. And then we can, like... We have successfully arrived Sneak at the orbital lab, Captain, and we are still in one piece. Shall I congratulate myself, or would you like to do the honors? Yay, we survived again. Something tells me next time I speak to that bitch, we won't be on peaceful terms. Over a monitor, I'll be like shoving a gun down her throat or something. I'm really not too sure, though. These people that speak over stupid... I'm like, I'm gonna call this person. You stole my shit. I want it back. 
Let's go talk to Phineas. With his bulletproof glass. I've kept myself busy in your absence. Optimized my formula. I'm now confident I can revive the remaining colonists. All I need now is the dimethyl sulfoxide. I'll take as much as you can give me. I took it all. What? Oh, yes, well, that's obvious. Anyone with two working lamps can see this colony slouching toward oblivion. Why do you think we've been doing all this? I revived you to help me save Halcyon from annihilation. It gets worse. The chairman's planning on freezing every single worker in Halcyon. Hold on. Let me see if I understand this correctly. You're saying that Halcyon's on the brink of total collapse? And the chairman's plan to save all of us is to save himself? I always knew Halcyon was heading toward a system's collapse, but I never imagined we were already there. The board made this crisis, and now they want to solve it by freezing the rest of us? That's not a plan. That's a goddamn escape clause. That makes two things we don't have. Time and chemicals to revive the other settlers. None of this was supposed to happen. I was supposed to revive the Hope's colonists. We were supposed to have enough time to solve the problem before we all starved. I found your chemicals in the ministry. The board was testing them on human subjects. Human test subjects? Oh, that's grotesque. That's unthinkable. That's exactly what I'd expect out of the board. I had to let all the test subjects die, but I brought you back all the chemicals they had. Thank you. You've brought me enough chemicals to get started, at least. I'm just sorry they came at the cost of human lives. Those poor people, they must have died in agony. What exactly was the board trying to accomplish? Something about repeatedly reviving humans from the extended hibernation? What nonsense! People aren't just slabs of meat the board can freeze and thaw at their convenience. I'll tell you this much. The board scientists are hopelessly lost. After years of fruitless experimentation, they've made exactly zero progress. What makes you say that? I used to work for these people. I'm intimately familiar with the utter incompetence of the board's own scientists. We're out of time. We're out of chemicals. We may very well be out of options. If the board has their way, we're all going to be spending the rest of our lives frozen in stasis. Do you realize what this means for the hope? For your fellow colonists? The board's going to kill them all. Toss them out into space just to make room in their hibernation chambers. So that's it. We just give up. I went through not all this for nothing. No, no, it wasn't. We have. Well, let's see. We we have at least some of the chemicals. We have your ship, and we have you. Let us account for something. Do you know what's waiting for us on the Hope? Scientists, engineers, artists, the brightest minds Earth ever sent us, uncorrupted by the board. The board's going to dispose of them all and transform the Hope into a prison for the rest of us. They're likely on their way to the Hope as we speak. We need to get to those colonists before the board. I have enough chemicals to start reviving a few of them, but no easy way to get them off the Hope. There's a way, it's not exactly safe, but we could skip the Hope into the system. Merciful gibbering law, you're a genius! We bring the Hope to us? Skip the entire ship across the distance of colony space, right next to my lab. The hose probably damaged will have to route power from the unreliable. Yes, yes, exactly. You're a step ahead of me, but I perceive the shape of your plan. If we link up the hope to the unreliable, then use your navigational computer to calculate a reasonably safe vector, we can skip the entire colony ship into the rings of Terra 2. 
I don't know much about skip drives, not the physics, anyhow. I do know the Hope's real massive. How's our bitty little ship supposed to skip it? Excellent question, my sharp-witted mechanic. You will use your own ship to power up the Hope skip drive. Your navigational computer can handle the rest. You'll need to switch on the Hope's auxiliary power using the Unreliable. Then, head to the bridge. Your navigational computer, Ada, should be able to activate the Hope skip drive. Once you've skipped the Hope oh next to my land, gosh. I'll have easy access to the frozen colonists. I can start reviving them immediately. We'll get to that another day, though. I'll do it. I know you're wondering why I'm doing all this. Why I believe the people on the Hope are the answer to the colony's problems. The Hope is carrying some of the most brilliant thinkers, scientists, engineers, experts. You can now travel to the Hope. If we work together, we can still find a way to save Halcyon. The board would have us believe Halcyon is beyond saving. I choose to believe otherwise. If there's even the slightest chance we can save Halcyon from oblivion, then we have to take it. Let's go. And I guess that's it for now. I'll most likely catch you later for another episode of The Outer Worlds. Until then, catch you later.